ho, ho, bitches. It's your boy Blast from Miss HD. <laughs> How am I not banned yet, man? You know what's really funny? What's something I find real funny about uh, YouTube? At least me on YouTube. I've seen a lot of big content creators get a lot of shit for the shit that they say. But, like, I don't ever get shit for the shit that I say. Like, people like me, the Hodge Twins, Filthy Frank, uh, uh, iDubbbz, we never get shit for the fucked up shit that we say. Because I feel like y'all know that that's who we authentically are. You feel me? I feel like the internet doesn't give a fuck about the fuck stuff that you do as long as you're up front with it. You feel me? But if you try to come out and say, oh man, I'm the most God-fearing person in the world and you find out that like this nigga skins cats in his spare time, that's when y'all come out. But if I, I could come on stream or the on camera wearing like a full-on wombat skin coat that I made myself, still bloody and everything, and y'all be cool with it, Cause y'all be like, well, I mean, like, you know, winter's coming up. Like, that's just how BHD saves money. He makes his own coats. Like, y'all little... <laughs> Okay, so what it is... <laughs> okay, so what it is is today, we're here to react to a video that a lot of you guys have been trying to get me to watch for the longest fucking time. It's called the Black People Song. You guys wanna hear, you guys wanna hear something real funny? Tell me why my brother has, like, very low amount of subscribers, right? He got 184k on watching the Black People song, but Akasan, who literally has double his subs, got like 27k, and they reacted to it at the same amount of time, man. I, I don't know. Maybe it's because Akasan doesn't really, you know, nobody really thinks Akasan's black. But uh. <laughs> We gonna edit all that out, but I was just making sure I'd never watched this video before, but even if I did, I don't fucking remember the damn thing. So, today we are here to, to, to watch and or check out the Black People song. Now I hear it's fucked up, and it's racist, and it's jacked up, but honestly, after watching Rucka Rucka's fuck shit videos, it can't be worse than that, you know? But, you know what? Um... It could be, you know, it is very, very fucking possible. I remember like, I think a year ago, I listened to like maybe 10 seconds of this song and I turned this shit the fuck off. And I legit, I remember legitimately looking this guy up, trying to find him on Facebook to let him know how much of a piece of shit he was for putting this bullshit out. So let's see if it is anywhere near as offensive as I remember it used to being. <laughs> Fucking black people song. But the shit that fucked me up about this, the, but the shit that, the shit that fucked me up about this song is the fact that it's made by a legit black dude. It's like, bro, what are you, what are you doing? You're black too, but you know what? Let's check it out though, cause it probably ain't, cause one thing I've learned from doing these vids is acceptance of how shitty people are. You know, I've learned to, to understand that people are shitty after they're shitty. Like I keep, I don't know why, but I keep expecting sacks of shit ass people not to be sacks of shit. I don't know why, you know? And that's where I be failing at, but you know what? We gonna check this shit out, let's do it. If you guys wanna watch the original video, the link's in the description down below. Make sure to go check him out. He's got other songs about other races of people, you know, so go subscribe to him if you want to. Um, let go. Let's do it, man. Let's see what it is. This song is dedicated to a certain kind of watermelon and chicken. God, God damn it. Look, first of all, I, I don't like watermelon. It's too slippery. <laughs> That's the first time I've ever said that. Uh, pause, I think. I meant vagina. But yeah, uh, watermelon's too slippery. You know, um, so I don't really got, I like watermelon flavored drinks, but look, okay, and I will say this here for everybody, I ain't in front of all of y'all, okay, if you don't like chicken, okay, there's not something wrong with me, I ain't, there's something wrong with you, I ain't, first of all, chicken is not a black thing, I know everybody enjoy good fried chicken, nigga, that shit is delicious as fuck. I, and if you don't like fried chicken, then there's something wrong with you. You fucking up. Not me, because I'm 
I'm smart enough to know that the shit's delicious. Go talk shit about me because I've got good taste. <laughs> That's just fucked. People. Kool-Aid just so happens. First of all, you know what? I do love Kool-Aid. I Okay, and and if you don't, then you just don't know how to make the shit correctly. You feel me? Because everybody knows that there's like a, a, a very important amount of like sugar to actually Kool-Aid and you got to even them out because if you don't do that good then the Kool-Aid either tastes like tap water or the shit is so thick that you got to eat it with a fork and even then you got to chew the shit to get it down your throat. You know what I mean? You got to get your balance of sugar to Kool-Aid ratio right. To be basketball. My favorite kind of people. You know, the ones that, you know, you're standing next to them and it all of a sudden it gets dark. I mean, I mean, you know, your your best friend is, you know what I'm saying, right? All right, yep. This is gonna be bad. <laughs> I'm already kind of triggered. You know, you're standing next to your best friend and it gets kind of dark. I'm fucking, oh, ooh. If I had some, ah, bitch, I wonder if it makes me look bad did I legitimately have like a bottle of hot sauce like right close? Is that racist? Does this make me look like the type of person that should be in this video? Like he's talking about me? Like, but it's not, I don't have it for my chicken. So that makes it better. But actually this is for my hot Cheetos. I put hot sauce on my hot Cheetos. I, it's like my thing, dude. It's fucking delicious, yo. Yeah. Black people. I'ma steal your shoes. You better hide your wallet, cause I'ma take that too. Black people. Alright, yep, this is gonna be fucked. You dirty son of a bitch. Like, really? I just gotta, I just. God damn it. Hey. Black people, one big family with a really big bucket of KFC. Black people. You motherfucker! Seriously, like all of us are related. You to an old amigo named Juan Luis, the Mexican called me Apple cause we both hang Oh! Oh no! No! Oh no! Okay! Oh! This is gonna be that type of shit! Oh! No he didn't! Because we both hang from trees! You. <laughs> the shit that fucked me up is this dude is black! What are you doing right now? Trees. now I I kind of took that in a joking way But was he talking about monkeys of the KKK? We don't get sunburnt, just ash and knees And we don't chew tobacco, but we will smoke weed Puff, puff, pass like the train that could And we can't spell neighbor, so we call it the hood and Can't spell neighbor, so we call it the hood I mean... I hope, I hope some of his friends, like, they're black and they saw this song and beat his ass. I really hope. I hope they whooped his ass for this. I wouldn't whoop his ass. I hope someone else does, though. Like, if I, if I walked up on black people beating his ass, I would, I would take out my phone and start recording and start yelling world star. And if the police came, like, I would, like, pull out a gun and start shooting another what direction and start running to distract him. No, you guys keep beating his ass. I'll, I'll take care of the cops. Like, you know what I mean? Like, this. <sighs> he needs to get his. He just needs. Chicken eating, melon sucking, lone fetus, weed smoking, long penis. Well, you get the picture. They tried to keep us out the White House again, but just like all White Houses, one of us broke. My favorite color is purple, by the way. A black woman came to me to bash my song I told her all blacks are democrat Now prove me wrong Black people, I'ma steal your shoes You better hide your wallet Cause I'ma take that too Black people Hey Black people, one big family With a really big bucket of KFC Black people Wait, what the fuck type of Black guy plus black girl plus sex equals family minus the guy. Oh, you little bitch. Oh, you, you dirty mother I just got that. I literally got it when I was, I was wondering like black guy versus plus black girl plus sex equals family. Like what the fuck? Minus the father, you, 
dirty motherfucker. You dirty motherfucker. I think I might have to retract my earlier statement of beating his ass personally. He needs to be slapped. And really? it doesn't have to be KFC. We like Popeye's business too. Hey, hey. Popeye's chicken is pretty good though. Uh, they have real good biscuits. Uh, we gonna edit that out because it, it doesn't help the, my case of saying this guy ain't shit agreeing with his food choices. Yeah, check it. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It always starts out that way, right? Yeah. Now there's a line between- Motherfucker, the you can't say that. You're a rapper too. You're just not good at it. This dude is legitimately a rapper, bitch. You literally fit the stereotype. How the fuck you gonna talk shit and yes, you? Some in are not in different places. You are if you use the N-word, but if you're black, then you're not racist. I mean, well, I guess you can. Just not around your black friends. You'll get jumped by every cousin, including the one behind that trash can. Now, that For, look, first off, man, that's 100% real, okay? I can't even talk no shit. You say the N-word around us, we will just beat your ass. It's not our fault. You know what I mean? But you, we at least usually give you like a warning. You feel me? We'll be like, hey man, don't do that. You know, and if you do it again, we kind of have to kick your ass. I'm not, I mean, don't lie about that. That's, you know, but you knew what this was. Let me tell you a story back before America was stolen. There were two tribes of black people, the Indians and the Poans. The Indians were like caramel. The Poans were like Sharpies. I guess that's why they called them pilgrims and why they called us darkies. The Indians had all the horses, land turkeys, the geniuses. The Poans killed their horses, took their hair and their penises. But uh, there's not really a moral to the story though, except that we will steal your goodies. And that is how the story goes. I'm gonna listen to the white people song after this. And it better be just as fucked up too. You little, I swear, you little bitch. It better be fucked up too. Okay, this is only okay if everyone else gets it the same. All right, but if it's just us, then we will put all of our feet, no matter how big a shoe size it is, into your anus. All right, and I'm gonna wiggle my toes when I get that shit up there too. Keep fucking stomping, and I'm a river dance in your ass. And that is that is a threat. You, you dirty, dirty son of a bitch. Hey. Black people, one big family with a really big bucket of KFC. Black people. What? White person plus, plus chicken equals chicken KFC plus white person to the 20th power. Since 72 Going broke Making cheap cars Taller than you Black people What? That don't make no sense White person plus car Equals Car with On big huge spinning rims Plus white person Minus money Okay you got it again We do have some nice rims Though right? Black people Porch monkey with a blunt and a banana. Ooh, I E E. Black people. Black people don't even like bananas. You stupid motherfucker. I, I can already tell what type of person we're at would make this video, yo. This dude, 100% is not accepted by the black community. That's always what it is. You see it all the time. I see it all the time, at least. If you ever run into a black guy that hates black women, that's because black girls don't like his fuck ass. It's real shit. I see it all the fucking time. I know this dude who used to be a real close personal friend of mine. He was like, I don't like black girls. I don't like black girls. And I, I would constantly have to tell him, like, look, like, like, look, you got to shut that shit the fuck up. Like, you a real good friend of mine, but I'm legitimately not going to be your fucking friend if you keep talking that shit. My mom's black. My sister's black. Shut the fuck up. You know, because you sound bitter right now, right? Guess who his goddamn girlfriend of the last year and a half has been? A black girl. Because he finally found one that fucking liked him. Fucking word? I knew this one uh, asshole back in uh, college. I mean, not that I went to college, but I used to kick it there for all the bad bitches. And uh, college got some bad sorority bitches. So I, I, I was there and this dude was like, yo, I don't like black girls, blah, blah, blah. You know, and like my girl was, uh, the girl I was dating at the time was like close by. And I had, to, I had to stop him and tell him like, look, my girl's black. Shut the fuck up. 
Just shut the fuck up. Tell me why a month later I catch this dude hitting on the darkest girl I've ever seen in my life. Like not even to be funny or mean, this chick was legit purple. Like she was that black, like she was that dark. And and he and he was always talking shit. Oh, I don't like black girls. I don't date black girls. I don't like black girls. But he but when he was trying to talk to her, I had to go and get him in to the chick, like get the girl to talk to him because he didn't have the balls or the fucking know-how to talk to the chick. You know what I mean? So it's all only only weak black dudes. If you ever run into a black dude or a black woman that doesn't like black men or women or doesn't like their own race of men or women or, or gender or whatever their opposite gender, they're just weak ass, bitter ass individuals. And that's real. They're usually just fuck boys or fuck girls or they're just fucking losers or lames. You see it all the time. I heard this one story about this black guy who used to make YouTube videos about how he hated black women. They were huge sacks of shit. They were just, just, just talking, just, just complete, just, just some of the shit he said, I can't even repeat here about black women. It's fucked up. But then he legitimately started stalking this black girl at the, in the college class who was also a YouTuber. You guys might have heard the story. He ended up murdering her because she wouldn't date him and then killed himself. You know what I mean? Like, how you go? That's like me talking about, man, I hate pizza. Fuck pizza. You know what I mean? I never touch a pizza in my goddamn life and then killing myself because no one will give me a slice. Like, you know what I mean? Like setting the pizzeria on fire because they won't give me some and then killing myself because I couldn't have some. Never understand. This is probably the most racist song I've ever written. But if you laugh, you're racist too. So I don't feel bad. Caring racism one laugh at a time. See, that's the only thing I don't like, man. If you're going to say some fuck shit, stand behind it. But quit trying to, like, hee-hee it up. You know? Like, you know what I mean? That's, that was my problem with that other dude with the really shiny uh, buff ankles that I was talking shit about. Like, if you going to... If you, don't say some real fucked up shit. Stand behind it and say, yeah, I said it. Yeah, this is who I am. You know, I'm not. I'm not going to change. This is just the type of person I am. But when you do the shit and then you try to say, oh, no, man. You know, this was just jokes. See, look. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Like, bruh. Get, get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Like, bruh. Did, no. No. But, yo. I mean, we about to, we, we about to uh, shoot the video of uh, me reacting to the white people song, so we gonna see how much of a sack, we gonna see, cause he went hard on black folk, we gonna see how hard he go on the white folk, and we gonna, you know what I mean, we gonna see if this dude is legit, just doing this shit for jokes, or if he's really got a problem, and he made the other white people and other racist songs, you know, just so that people will be like, oh, see, he hates everybody, he's just talking shit about everybody, it's just a joke, but yo, hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you did, make sure to comment, like, and don't subscribe, yeah, this person could never, come anywhere near me, or you can suck my balls. But, Twisms, oh, oh. And uh, I also suggest, if you haven't seen it, you guys also go and watch the skit that me and my, home, me and my homies we shot. We plan on shooting other ones. Uh, I got a couple other ones in the works. Uh, the link will be in the description down below for the horror skit, but I got a couple of them in the works. One of them is probably, I'm probably gonna shoot like a Young Metro Don't Trust You uh, skit. And then Netflix and chill or else. And then a couple other ones. I got a lot of funny fucking ideas for skits. But, yep. Twiz Ops. That's some, that's some Gucci main shit. Uh -huh.